Georgia has quickly become one of the fastest growing states in America. It's known for having great food, sweltering heat, amazing sports environments, and friendly folks. Georgia has beautiful mountains in the north, amazing coastal towns to the east, and arguably the south's most important city. Georgia is geographically unique. Georgia borders Florida, South Carolina, Alabama, Tennessee, and North Carolina. These states that surround Georgia would be on the top of many lists for most moved to states over the last few years. So today, we're going to see why Georgia is unique among a growing area and why it could be the right fit for you. Atlanta is the media capital of the Deep South and has a large influence over the region and the country. The average median home price in Georgia is around $300,000 and the median household income is $65,000. This makes it pretty reasonable to afford a home in Georgia. Like anywhere, there are some markets that are tougher than others. If you can't afford a home, the property taxes are quite a bit less than the national average, and really, the income tax and sales tax are in a reasonable range too. Economically, Georgia is one of the states you can definitely make a great income, especially if you are in the Atlanta area. The great thing is, it's far from the only benefit. The state of Georgia has a violent crime rate that is 7% less than the national average. Obviously, there are places to avoid, but the state as a whole is pretty safe. Their property crime rate is a bit higher than you'd like to see, but ultimately, you could do a lot worse than Georgia. Georgia is a very diverse state, where 53% of residents are white, 31% of residents are black, 9% are Hispanic, 4% are Asian, 0.2% of residents are Native American, and 2% of residents are two or more races. Georgia, particularly Atlanta, is a hub for entrepreneurship, innovation, and business. In particular, this is a region where black business tends to thrive. Well over half the state's population resides in the Atlanta area. In addition to business, great sports, music, nightlife, and food are easily some of the most attractive elements of this area. Outside of the Atlanta area, there are many other attractive places to consider too. In Georgia, the state is pretty even politically. However, it seems to lean to the right a bit more. The most recent presidential race was hotly contested here and ultimately went Democratic. But the governor's race was a 7.5% margin that went to the incumbent, Governor Kemp. As you can imagine, the rural areas are very conservative and the cities are liberal. If you are liberal but want to live in a small county, there are some decent options in Georgia. However, if you want to live somewhere that is conservative, there are more limitations if you want to live in the city. In Georgia, they have mild winters throughout most of the state, and the average is 33 degrees for the January low but their summers are anything but mild. They average 90 degrees, but with a humidity that very few places can match. They also get more than a foot of rain than the national average, while also managing to get a couple more weeks of sunshine than average too. They only get about one inch of snow on average, which for me is a huge plus for Georgia. And since you are off the Atlantic, you need to be prepared for hurricanes if you choose to call East Georgia home. Overall, you have to be able to take large amounts of rain and humidity for Georgia to work for you. If you are visiting the city, you'll have beautiful urban parks to explore, great historical venues, museums, and nightlife. Outside of Atlanta, you can enjoy their beautiful lakes and mountains. The Appalachian Mountains start here and go all the way up to Maine. Georgia has beautiful coastal towns and lots of spots to enjoy outdoor sports. Georgia is home to some of the most well-regarded southern food in America. If you've never had southern food, 
this may be one of the best food tourism states to try. The coastal area is beautiful, and there are reasons why visiting places like Savannah and Tybee Island are so popular. The people are known to be friendly in Georgia. That is why the Masters Golf Tournament is such a great fit for Georgia and is one of their biggest events each year. The only time Georgians are likely to get mean is on the football field. The University of Georgia's football team is practically making the national championship game their invitational at this point. One other fun fact, their tuition is pretty affordable here at the university last I checked. I thought about going here and found it to be pretty reasonable. Earlier, we touched on some culturally unique elements about Atlanta. Let me elaborate on some differences between Atlanta and other parts of the state. Atlanta has one of the largest airports in the country, with great rates and availability to travel to other parts of the country. But the traffic in Atlanta is genuinely some of the worst in America. If you enjoy road trips, you can go to Florida quickly, Nashville, the Great Smoky Mountains National Park, or Carolina's Great Beaches. So if you love traveling in the states and want to live in an urban place, Atlanta may be one of the best options in the country. Now, if Georgia sounds like the place you want to call home, but you're not sure where you want to live or even that you'd want to live in the big city, look for my next video, which will help you decide where you should move in the state of Georgia or somewhere else. Thanks so much for watching and take care.